can't even... Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you've never been here before, welcome. My name is Christine. So I wanted to show you guys how I do microneedling at home and this video is actually in partnership with Banish. And before we go ahead and get started, please make sure you hit the subscribe if you haven't already and the little notification bell. And let's go ahead and get started. So in the Banish starter kit, it does come with a derma roller and this one has longer needles than ones that I've tried before, but I really like it and it's really effective on my skin. It also comes with the Banish oil, vitamin C, Beauty Elixir which is in the form of a spray and I love this stuff for spraying during the day or before or after my moisturizer. Also comes with the pumpkin enzyme mask which is like a natural exfoliating mask and then the activated charcoal clay mask. Before we get into it too I kind of wanted to talk about my skin and in high school I don't know if you saw it in my skincare routine but in high school I had like pretty bad acne and it wasn't like a lot but I would get like one or two big pimples all over my face and they would leave scarring so I had a lot of scarring issues and I've just always had really oily acne prone skin so ever since graduating high school I've been drinking a lot of water and trying to take good care of my skin. I had professional microneedling done and I loved it and ever since then I picked up a derma roller and I've been like trying out microneedling at home and I really like it and I've seen results over time so I'm a big fan of it and um, the Banish kit I have been using for almost a month now and I really like it and I love the brand story. I love that the owner Daisy, she used to have really bad acne problems and it caused like a lot of self-confidence issues and obviously if you have acne you're kind of like self-conscious of it all the time and you feel like you can't really be you and you're not comfortable in your own skin and she kind of like found a solution and it was microneedling and she created her company because she also wanted to help people that are going through the same thing. I love the brand story and every order is made the next day and it is like a small package so you could go through it really quick if you're using it multiple times a week um, and that way you know they're not using a lot of like preservatives and stuff like that so it's more pure better ingredients that's going into your skin so I really love that. A lot of people say that like microneedling at home is not very good because you can't sanitize it as well but what you're supposed to do is soak it in alcohol for like five minutes before use. I have a little bottle of alcohol and this one is 91% alcohol. It comes with a little container. I just fill it up with alcohol and then I will soak this in the alcohol solution and leave it in there for five minutes every time I use it and then when I'm done using it, soak it in alcohol again. So that way it at least kills a lot of the bacteria that's on it but you're supposed to replace the derma roller after like three or four times of usage. And I only use it about every two weeks, so you're supposed to replace it after two months. It's a safe way to use it if you sanitize it correctly and you're throwing it away when you need to and not using it way too many times. And then another great thing about the company too is they ship worldwide. And if you're not happy with any of their products, they have a 30 day money back guarantee. So this video is done in partnership with Banish and I would never back up something that I don't fully wholeheartedly support. And I love their products and I've been trying out for the last month, like I said. Banish products are not only for people that have like active acne on their skin it could be for people that have like acne scars or if you just want to improve the elasticity of your skin I really like microneedling for that it's like a common misconception that like derma rolling is only for people that have like crazy scars or people with acne microneedling also has other great benefits like it promotes collagen production in the skin it reduces wrinkles and your acne scars and it also fades hyperpigmentation that's what I use it for now because I don't have like that many issues with my acne and acne scarring so anyways that is everything and another Enough talking let's get into how I use the products okay now that I have cleansed my face all of my makeup is completely off and I don't have any moisturizer or anything so as you can see like there is a little bit of redness and there is a little bit of discoloration around my nose and you can see there is a little bit of scarring and some texture on my forehead but this is what my skin looks like before so first starting off we're actually gonna multi mask I'm gonna use the banish activated charcoal clay mask in my t-zone and where I get oily and have a little bit of texture and then the pumpkin enzyme mask on my cheek so first starting off I have a little bowl and I put some of the charcoal um, powder in here and I'm just gonna put a little bit of water and I'm just gonna mix it up and then I do like the consistency of this to be a little bit thinner and not like too too thick and so I'm gonna go ahead and buy this in my t-zone okay and then on the other areas of my face I'm gonna use the pumpkin enzyme mask and the glare it feels like sprite like the fizziness of it um, it just feels really good on your skin and I could feel it exfoliating my skin. So anyways, I'm going to leave those two on for about 15 minutes and I will be right back. 
Now that it's right on my face, I'm just gonna go ahead and wash this off and I will be right back. So this is what my skin looks like after the face mask and it feels really fresh and tight around these areas and on my cheeks where I had that pumpkin mask, it feels super smooth. I'm a huge fan of those masks and now we are gonna go in with Derma Roller and I had this soaking in alcohol while I was doing my mask so now it is disinfected and I'm gonna go ahead and zoom you in and show you how I use this. Okay, so starting off and I'm just gonna roll over the same spot five times. Over and do another section. Switch directions and go again. And this feels like little pricks on your skin, like it's not that irritating. And these needles are a little bit longer than derma rollers that I've used before, but I don't mind it. And then I'm gonna skip my nose and move on to my forehead. Right. Next, I'm going in with the banish oil. So I'm just gonna put two to three drops in my hand. And I'm just gonna pat that all over my face. And after derma rolling, my, my skin just drinks the stuff up. And I can just feel it sinking into my skin. Next, I'm gonna spray my vitamin C beauty elixir just to get a little bit moisture back into my skin. And then I'm gonna go apply a little bit of eye cream and I will be right back. So this is what my skin looks like right after and I'm actually just gonna go to bed and show you what it looks like in the morning cause I do have a little bit of redness because right after the microneedling, my skin is a little bit um, irritated. I'm gonna go ahead and go to bed and I will show you what my skin looks like in the morning. And I don't know if you can see, but my forehead, there is still a little bit of texture, but my skin overall feels a lot smoother. Um, a lot of the discoloration um, has been evened out and even over here where I used to have a little bit of like scarring it looks like it's been faded a little bit and I'll put the before and after side by side so you can kind of see next to each other obviously the lighting this morning is a little bit different than when I was filming yesterday you can get a pretty good idea and I wanted to say a quick thank you to Banish before we end this video all their products and I love their microneedling tool and I think you can totally do microneedling at home if you sanitize it correctly and throw it away after three or four uses and their mask and their oils and stuff like that are all natural ingredients and I love that and anyways that brings us to the end of this week's video I hope you guys enjoyed and if you did please give this video a thumbs up let me know down in the comments what you'd like to see next and as always thank you so much for watching and I will see you in next week's video bye guys